And let's get back to the bourbon industry, all American, feeling the pain from tariffs placed there by the Europeans. Jeff Flock, he's at the Peerless Distillery in Louisville, Kentucky. All right, spell it out. How are European tariffs affecting this American industry? 2,000 barrels of uh, Kentucky or whiskey, both bourbon and rye, I'm surrounded by. They intended to sell a number of these barrels in uh, Europe, but the Europeans targeted Americana like bourbon. So I asked the CEO of the company, this is the fourth generation, this is Henry Craver, who was, this is your great grandfather, was the founder of Kentucky Peerless Distilling, went out of business after the prohibition. Before uh, prohibition. Correct. You reinvigorated this business. I did, yes. You invested a lot of your money in it. I did. Now we got to put the numbers up. Stuart, if you would, would you put the numbers up? You were supposed to sell 2,500 2, cases. 2,500 cases to Europe. And how many have you sold? Zero. We, yeah. we just can't absorb the 25% tariff. Okay, now I got to ask you, hard question. Are you mad at the president over this? I'm not. I think it has to be equalized. I think, it, I think it'll be negotiated out. I think they not only affected the, the bourbon industry in Kentucky, but they went after Levi's, they went after Harley Davidson. And so it was pure Americana. Pure Americana, that's what it was. So yeah. it, it'll be worked out. Uh, it's just taken a little bit longer than we want it to take, but it, it's going to be worked out. This is Corky Taylor, who is, uh, well, you're, you're quite a guy, and over your shoulder is quite a guy. I'm going to leave you with this picture, Stuart. That is your father. That's my father, correct. Uh, he was General George S. Patton's chief of staff in World War II. He was, yes. He started in 1943, and then he ended the war with General Patton. Yeah, proud of him. So I grew up in Army, Brad. It wasn't all bad. It was great, great growing up. Yeah. Talk about a real piece of Americana on the bourbon trail here in uh, uh, Kentucky. Uh, Jeff, please He's, tell uh, the They're good, waiting for you here, Stuart. Please yes. tell me, the, t please tell the good gentleman there that we're proud to have him on this show. It's a great honor. Thank you very much, sir. Good stuff. I um, will convey that, sir. Please do. Thank you. That's bourbon for you. Yeah, All you American. Exactly. <laughs>